and uh, give everybody else a play. Yeah. And uh, uh, now they had easy up, so they easily took the move down, but they didn't want to take their weight. So they, they said, the, the, tornado, the storm's coming. What are you going to do? Well, the storm's two hours off. It takes me three hours to take this thing down. I can't. So they gave me all of their temporary, gave me all their weights and stuff, and piled it around my foot. And I put ratchet straps all around this thing. And uh, I went back home to the, the friend of a friend who I was staying with, and they, uh, I was watching the weather, and it said, tornado warning for all of Tulsa. I mean, okay, well, let's rehearse the phone call to the insurance company. Um, <laughs> got yeah. Came back the next morning, and this thing was still standing. I'm like, okay, fair enough. That's the power of one. triangles, man. Yeah. That's and getting it about. weighted down. Yeah. Yeah. It weighted down everything. Because you never know what the weather's going to be at no. these shows. I think the last one we were at, it was freezing cold. It was raining. Yeah. It was blowing. Well, it's raining yeah. at this one more often oh, yeah. than not. Yeah, I've always wanted them to move it back a couple of weeks or a month. Well, I wish they'd move it back to Main Street because yeah. it drains there. And There's you don't no, have to drain. no drainage here, yeah. yeah. It all collects right over there. Yeah. Like, oh, See, people don't believe me when I say I'm going to bring the duck back. <laughs> he knows. He yeah. I brought it to work. It's good. The duck is very good. It's huge, too. It's about the size of the thing. Yeah. <laughs> Where we help. Everybody's desperate for quite a while. Whoever was gone and inherited the duck. Yeah. <laughs> so, are these the new frames from that? New frames, yes. Yeah. Hang on. Hang on. Yeah. And you can buy it from uh, Frame Destination down in Dallas. Or I don't know of any place here local that sells this. Maybe Oklahoma City or Tulsa. Half inch thick. Now the advantage of Gator Board is that it's, uh, uh, as opposed to foam core. Yeah. Um, this has wood veneer on the outside rather than paper, and its thickness is it's it's such so that when you put glue on it, it's not going to bend and turn into a pretzel. The amount of glue that I have to use to glue down fabric on, or especially canvas on onto this board, I try I actually tried it on uh, on what is it, an eighth inch uh, uh, foam board, and it just curled up. Wow. And uh, but this stuff stays nice and straight, and it's light enough so that you can hang it with, with Velcro. Which looks a lot better when the wind blows and it's not bouncing yeah. around and dancing and stuff. And, yeah. Because yeah. yeah, you never know what the weather is going to be for these shows. Absolutely. So, so you guys have a booth? You don't have a booth? No, we don't have a booth. Oh, goodness. Yeah. We're just wandering around. Awesome. Doing, doing stuff. That. Okay. Put it, put it on the web later. Mm -hmm. So how many shows are you doing yeah, this you year? some Jolly Rancher folks. There you go. Mm -hmm. yeah. okay. How many shows are you doing this year? Uh, so far, three. Yeah. Um, because um, our, our trip to Italy, we've, uh, we're deciding to do it in May, which goes right over the top of uh, uh, Lawton, Tulsa, and then Paseo. Oh, Paseo, yeah. So uh, How? I'm, I'm thinking of the three of those versus Italy. Okay, yeah. we'll go to Italy. Uh, yeah. How long are you going to be in Italy then? Two and a half weeks. Okay. We, we keep talking about going to Europe. She's been twice. Yeah. And we want to get back over there and go shoot. Mm -hmm. So, yeah. sometime soon. Sometime soon. Soon, huh? Yeah. Hopefully, we'll go for it. Good idea. Did I get to show you the new box? Oh, yeah. You said David made that. This is the box that Dave helped me out with. Um, it's made a half inch, uh, uh, nine layer uh, uh, birch thing. Wow. Yeah. And uh, what he did, the best part is on the back. What we did, going down the inside, you can see all these pocket holes that we did. He used the CNC machine to pocket it out, and that thus making it lighter, lighter. but it's still just as strong. Yeah. yeah. So this whole thing empty, it weighs 50 pounds. If we hadn't done this, empty would have weighed probably about 80 pounds. Wow. And, and uh, I probably need to build another one because this is getting a little crowded. Cool.